Hey guys, it's Redemption9 and welcome back to Assassin's Creed 3. Last episode we had a midnight ride and warned people around the frontier that the British or the Redcoats were coming. Uh, oh, look, a dog. Hey, dog. Looks more like a wolf than a dog. Uh, but yeah, as I'm distracted by a dog, these people are waiting for me to start the next mission. So yeah, today we're going to do this mission where we defend the town, I suppose. So, hey, John Parker. Lexington. Stand your ground, men! Don't fire! Unless fired upon! But if they mean to have a war, let it begin here! Take care. Disperse, you damn rebels! Lay down your arms and disperse! What are you doing? Those who remain. Don't you lecture me, or not? Return fire! Return fire! You need to get to Concord and warn the others. Show this to whoever leads it. Should be a man by the name of James Barrett. Go on now! We could single-handedly take out all those people. Oh, should I have taken that horse? But yeah, we could have just taken out all them people expertly. Wow, almost expertly. Single-handedly. Without taking a bit of damage. Well, I suppose we would have taken damage, but not that much. And I suppose I should have taken that horse because it is probably faster. But you know, I hate horses. So, fuck horses. How far away is Concord? Uh, I fear I may run out of time. Uh, yeah, going on foot may not have been the best idea. But to Concord we go, no matter how long it takes. If I fail, then next time I will learn from my mistakes and take a horse. But this looks like Concord, so fuck the horse. And it's not that far away, to be honest. Help! What's happening? Ah, oh, shit. It's not. Is this Concord? Where is this? Yes, people, run. I run with you because I am one of you. I'm totally not a bad assassin who could just they kill everyone run! and run yeah. away from everyone like, run! pussies. Rescue civilian hostages. Oh my god, move out of the way, I'm a badass assassin. I will help. Come on. Bitch. Come on. Nailed it. Oh shit, I'm not gonna make that. 140 meters? Yeah, get away. We're gonna make it. Time for some shortcuts. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. I'm not going to make it in 34 seconds. No. I've got a surprise for those lobster backs. North Bridge. Yeah, I think next time I'm going to take the horse. No, wait, he's there. I see him. I nailed it. Blood's been spilled in Lexington, and there's more to come. The regulars are on the march. You don't say. And why do you think I'm men up here? Go home, or you get yourself killed. I have enough to worry about without some 
green boy looking to play at hero. I can vouch for him. John Parker as well. Where's Revere? Captured. What? Fear not. That man's no stranger to sticky situations. He'll be fine. I'm sure of it. <clears throat> you ladies finished gossiping? Parker seems to believe you're not completely useless, so... I suppose there's a thing or two you might be able to help with. When the fighting starts, we'll need to hold those positions there. They're critical to the defense of Concord. Good boys. Not used to soldier, and they need some with the experience to direct them. That's something you can do. You'd best be telling the truth. You have my word. Then I suppose all that's left to do is wait. Here they come. The British are coming. There's a lot of people Sir. I could kill there. Mount the barricades! No! Ensure my men hold those positions. If the Red Devils break through, we're finished. What would you have me do? Listen carefully. The red coats will form firing lines. Order the men to shoot just before the line is ready. Too soon and they'll miss their targets. Too late. And the enemy will open fire first. Understood. And if any of those bastards make it through, engage them. You must keep my men alive. Sounds like a lot of responsibility. Uh God. Nailed it. Wait for the signal. Shoot. Go. Why am I on a horse? Oh shit. What? Fire! This horse is going to be the death of me. Prepare yourself. Wait for my signal. Go! Do I have to be on this horse? Wait for the six. Shoot! I have to be on the fucking horse. I hate this horse. Go, kill. Make ready. I'm doing amazing though. Just kill. Make ready. Shoot. Wait for my signal. Make ready. Shoot. Shoot. Wow, there's so many to be defeated. Make ready. Go. Hold fire. Shoot. Come on. Make ready. Open fire. Kill him. Wait for my signal. Go. Come on, 91 out of 130. Come on. Can do this, boys. Wait for the signal. Open fire. Come on, Wait we're almost the there. Signal. Wait for my signal. This see, this horse is just so tedious. There's no Make point ready. in having a horse. I could just run and fr fucking Make run. Ready. I could run. Didn't I tell them to shoot? Make ready. Fire now. I swear I told you guys to shoot. Make ready. I nailed it though. Fall back. Fall back. We did it! They're turning tail!
near the talk to James Barrett. Where's my horse gone? Not that I miss it or anything. I'm glad to be rid of it. Mate, did we win? Takes a true monster to do something like this. At least they're gone. I should have struck when I had the chance. Do you know where Pitcairn could have gone? Back into the withered bosom of the British, no doubt. So that he may regroup and plan his next atrocity. I need to find him. Every day I wait, more will suffer. Chin up, friend. Many who should have died today now live because of you. And what of them? We do the best we can with what we've got. It is not enough. Hmm. It never is. Lexington and Concord, sequence 7 complete. Come on. Yes. 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 Full synchronization achieved. Awesome. For the support of the glorious cause, I beg they will accept my most cordial thanks for this distinguished testimony of their approbation. But lest some unlucky event should happen, unfavorable to my reputation, I beg it may be remembered by every gentleman in the room that I, this day, Declare with utmost sincerity, I do not think myself equal to the command I am honored with. Truly, there as is pay, no man better sir, suited I to beg the task. Leave to assure really? The Congress that I can no think of pecuniary several. Consideration could have Charles to Lee. Have accepted this arduous employment at the do I know you? I would not expect happiness. you to remember. <laughs> I do not wish to make someone I want you to meet. Me. I will keep an exact account of my expenses. Sorry to pull you away Those, like that, I doubt but not they the will last thing we need is the two of you coming to blows. Connor, allow me to introduce you to our newly appointed Commander-in-Chief, George Washington. Ah, so you're the one who saved Sam and John at Lexington. It was the Patriots who did that. I merely lent support. As humble as he is brave, we could use more men like you. I'm sorry, but if you'll excuse me, I should attend to Charles over there. He looks none too happy about being passed over for command. It was good to meet you, Connor. Let me know Tell me you have news of Pitcairn. I'm told he's taken shelter in Boston, where he's guarded by a thousand redcoats. The only way you're gonna get at him is if we draw him out. And lucky for you, we're launching an offensive against the city in order to do just that. Israel Putnam has been given command of our forces. Present this to him and he'll provide whatever aid you require. You'll find him at the encampment on Bunker Hill. You have my thanks. No need. It's the least I could do. Pitcairn's a dangerous man. The sooner we're rid of him, the better. I would say the same of Charles Lee. Now that's an altogether different beast. Let us leave it for another day. Best you head to Boston, Connor. So we just met George Washington, as you do. And then we had the chance to kill Charles Lee, but we couldn't do it. I'd just say fuck it and just kill him. What do you have to say? Still here, are you? I was just wondering what happens now. There's quite a lot to do. Commander Washington must determine when and where we'll strike next. And we need to get to work on our message. Message? We must contact the broadsheets at once. Ensure it's clear to everyone that it was the Loyalists who fired first in Lexington. But no one knows who fired first. Which is exactly why we must spread the news quickly. We'll determine public opinion. This seems dishonest. Perhaps, but so what? People must believe we acted in self-defense, else we've committed treason. But you have. Better to bow and scrape before a tyrant, then? Is that what you suggest? No, of course not. No one should be denied freedom. 
and yet to change the truth, it seems a dangerous road to travel. Understand, Connor. This is a war fought not just on the battlefield, but within hearts and minds as well. There's nothing wrong with a bit of theater, especially if it saves lives. Very, very true. I wonder what's upstairs. Uh, nothing by the looks of it. Right, so where are we? Boston. I just came out of building and suddenly I'm in a forest. Where am I? I'm literally on the corner. So if I go up here. What is up here? Is it just going to lead me to an invisible wall? Oh no, Boston. Right, okay, so I am back here. Oh my god, look at that view, it's so nice. Where have we got to go? Uh, where's that? Suppose we could go there? It's a long way away though. Can I make it? Is there anything we can do? It doesn't look like there's anything to do right now. Right, let's just go and hope for the best. We are 300 meters away. That is a lot of uh, water between me and that 300 meters. Let's just go on the beach, I guess. I mean, like, <laughs> we can't really swim because it takes so much longer. And no, I do not wish for a horse right now. A horse would slow me down. Even though they are supposed to be faster. But horses are shit. Hashtag fuck horses. This game does look nice. I know I say that all the time, but it looks nice. Look at it. Look how nice it is. Look at that horizon. Look at the beech wood. Look at the cliffs. And going up this way. We're getting closer. Uh, I didn't really want to go up there, but you know. It sort of slowed me down. Where is this? Am I going to talk to a rock? Is that what I'm going to do next? Talk to a rock? Actually, a horse? Who are you? Who the hell are you? Do you know who I am? Conflict looms. I'm looking for Israel Putnam. On whose orders? Samuel Adams. Follow me. This is not Bunker Hill. Aye, it's Briggs. There's been some disagreement as to where we should encamp. Any news from Boston? The Tories aren't moving. And any time we try to press them... Where am I? Where is this? Bunker Hill. Right, I'm in Bunker Hill. I think Putnam and the others plan to assemble artillery on these hills. A good shelling might make the Red Coast rethink their strategy. And what of John Pitcairn? That bastard's the cagiest of the bunch. He's appeared time to time to taunt us or send regards by way of cannon fire. It's all right, though. He'll have what's coming to him soon enough. Sounds like thunder. Is it going to rain? I've never been here before, yet the map is fully discovered. I see ships. I hear thunder. Oh, it might be cannon fire, I'm not sure. Oh, it's cannon fire. Speak with Israel Putnam. Hello. Continues its assault. We'll never flush him out. 
But if the ship was silenced... Oh, that might be forced to get off his arse and come forward. I supply this flag to signal my success. And I shall speak fondly of you at your funeral. So, I don't know if you guys heard that, but there was a Wilhelm screen there. And it's just so noticeable. Can I use the Aquila to take out this ship? Because uh, my ship is beast. It's very beast right now. This place is just... Oh my god. Um... Okay. So, can I climb over that? No. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, I like this bit. It's cool. Just everything is falling to bits around me. Oh my god. Have we got British coming? The English are here. What do you want me to do? Do you want me to swim? Do I just swim over to this? Air assassinate a grenade. Light the black powder. This should be easy enough. Though I don't, I don't see why I couldn't use my ship. Because my ship is better than this. No, climb. Climb. They saw me. Look at them all shooting at me, aww. They're assassinated. Will you give me a chance to counter? Hey, bitch. Come on then. Shoot him. Come on, reload. Reload and shoot. I want to air assassinate this guy. There we go. I oh, missed. Climb. Climb the thing. Bitch. Nailed it. Plant. Yes, let's plant a bomb. Nailed it. Did that, that's not even sinking. Right. Same. Uh, yes, it's the same as this one. Let's not get seen this time. Oh shit, we're gonna get seen. Bitch. Come on, come on. You fucker. There we go. One. Nailed it. Escape zone and become anonymous. Easy. Nailed it. Climb the mast. Oh. You could have told me that as I was swimming away. Well, before I started swimming away. Got to do it to both ships as well. This boat is burning. What's the point of putting a flag on it when it's burning anyway? Hmm. 
Man, it's so high. Come on. No, don't jump off. I need to get up. I need to fucking climb, man. There we go, nailed it. Remain undetected while on ships. Yeah, I fell down. Swim back to shore, easy enough. Ah, oh, okay. Damn it, I didn't get a full sink. Mount, oh, I don't want to mount the horse. Fuck horses, man. Follow the Patriot. Man, look at the dead bodies. I wonder if all these bodies are lootable. So much loot. Oh my god, so much money. Look how much destruction there is. Oh my god. It's insane. Mate, can you go any faster, please? Are we going up there? Yeah, we're going up there. Called it. You're gonna give a speech now. For what they have in material, they lack in conviction and care. But not us. We have discipline. We have order. And most importantly, we have fashion. We believe. To so maintain vigilance, preserve travel, ensure a proper line of sight, and above all else, men. Do not fire until you see the whites of their eyes. Oh my god, everyone's moving. Love me, Dan. You did it. That was quite a speech. Lies, all of it, I'm afraid. Still. Such words have carried us thus far. And what a pit carn. He's left Boston. As I said, he would. He set up camp on Bolton Hill. There's no good way to get out of him. Not with that mail truck rolling down below. I suppose you could circle around a bit. And wait for us to fit their ranks. There's no time. I will have the chance of direct approach. That's twice today you proposed the impossible. I see no other choice. Not because you're mad as a March hare, son. I expect an apology on my return. Alright, yeah, okay. Um... I can totally do that with no damage. Totally not going to work. I think here though is a good place to end it. We're just about to go through no man's land. And get shot to death by a little bit. So yeah, next episode is going to be fun. But for now, that's it for this episode guys. And uh, I'll see you next time. Where we go for a suicide run. See you next time. Bye.